story. So let's talk media people. And uh, we are talking about Willis Raburu and Jerry Mudengi. So hashtag the Pal Nation. <laughs> so what happened? Um, recently it was Joey's birthday and Willis Raburu went online to wish her a happy birthday. And... Uh, let me just read what he wrote. Happy birthday to you at Joey. I don't even know where I can start to describe how much you mean to me. You are a perfect example of fire and light and calmness wrapped up in a human body. God's, God's love shines th through you. Through you, okay. And beams across to the world. You go, girl. Shine on this world is your stage. Keep putting on a stellar performance and when it gets um, tough, just know this, your coaster will always be with you on this stage called life happy birthday oh. young jay and this is what joey wrote eh? i am crying right now i don't even know what to say i love you so much like i can't even you already know i could google nice words but i won't i just love you and i'm thankful for you for you so story in at okay apa ambapo please kumbuka hizo stories za emotional kuna sababu <laughs> watch out watch out <laughs> i'm like ah hii ni story nzuri jamani you all about positive vibes it's just monday so the story is ne social media people let it people <laughs> netizens hata siju tuna fake kuwapatia tu a special name for you guys eh? they're called netizens citizens mm. of the internet you, you you are special people you went online to assume there is a love affair to assume yeah. they, they they have something to to yeah. assume okay. things which are not even there ah ah omera they are friends so <laughs> adi joy <laughs> aliandika commenting nena kaandika uh, just a pal come on you to like you know like you have to <laughs> confirm to guys when you post hey, with a guy over there be like hey, hashtag just, just a pal <laughs> so, yeah, but, yeah. no one starts assuming that you guys have a thing yeah, man. so happy it's birthday to you though. joy by the way what happy happy birthday. Birthday. to platonically you know but you don't tell your friends I love you. Yeah. yeah. It's normal to tell I your friends I love you. It doesn't have to be a romantic yeah. thing. relationship. Yeah. It can be platonic and just that. Mm -hmm. yes. All right. <laughs> Talking about relationships that are not very platonic. Well, not platonic at all. Esme Platinum's got married, y'all. Remember we talked about this last week. I think Thursday. Kulikuwa na Rusi Pale and they were doing a live um a live feed on YouTube for everybody to watch from wherever they they are and it was a beautiful spectacular spectacular event and it was organized by diamond and he made sure that this is the wedding that everybody is gonna be talking about and he said i'm not going to uh a few weeks ago alikuwa meka launch ya ilikuwa thanksgiving ya zuchu na kulikuwa na dress code na time ya kufika kwa event guys wawaku take care of the dress code mm. hawaku fika on time and he said these are the rules i'm setting for my sister's wedding so y'all all better get in line this is the time okay could you let my friend the uh, the dress code is uh, maroon and uh, blush pink we will not <laughs> welcome you umekuja umevaa kala zako uko blue sijui green sijui red no and then yani we can't ignore the bride yani she had the three sets of wedding gowns that three. night and they looked beautiful i think the most beautiful one was where she was wearing like a cinderella beautiful gown oh, it was wow. it was really nice but yeah so, rules and doors oh where are the other wives when this is happening ah, do okay. they not attend or do they attend and just oh alikonga bibi wangapi tena watatu mmoja yuko SA mwingine Tanzania sasa sijui i don't know Ooh. i don't know if i think they are welcomed the muslim community yeah, in akwalao yeah. and he has space for one more hi kami kana za get wedding dress tatu i'm joking don't i don't you know why the three dresses we want to get four wives at a get four dresses but where I'm yeah. like okay so na kuangalia team ya enye nikikosa anga kala ina kai kitu niomba ni kuzelewa nitakuja tu na kitu nitakaa nayo so kidogo maybe hapo even ingekuwa nimekuwa nje 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 but kushu una like, following ya rules at eh, least tunajaribingi eh, with fashion you don't play around mbali, oh, you don't somewhere eh, there but I'm like people's team you know? sema rules na hata si harusi yako ah, imagine ah. 
Sorry, I okay. think yeye ndo alikuwa na throw ili kwa harusi kama I think ya tatu or whatever. They said mm. I do I think 30th then first there was a party. Mm. Like it was just and then they'd okay. gotten married before but that was very intimate even mm. mama mama yake hakuwa na mm. pia nani hakuwa lakini tuna video tafadhali pengine tu atatu onye shule. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Binafsi na ombi langu nikiwa kama miongoni mwa mwanakamati sio ombi ni lazima. Lazima tuheshimu mwe. Shule itaanza saa kumi. Lengo la kuanza saa kumi kwa sababu ni shule ya kipekee yake kia aina yake kitu tofauti. Nataka tupate kitu tofauti. Sio mtu eti marusi paka fike na wewe ndo ufike. Eti uangalie tu demoni kaingia, uangalie tu fani kaingia na wewe ndo uje hapana. Mdao kwa kufika au ifika. Lakini nyingine lazima tuzingatie dress code. Yaani mtu tusifanye mambo kama kwenye zuchu wengine wanataka kujiongeza mtu kaja na gauni jekundu ma nini shule sio yako ndugu yangu hii shule umealikwa fata utaratibu na usipofata utaratibu utaishia nje kwa sababu kikweli walikwa ni wengi na hapa tumhitaji sana sana mtu ambaye anafata kadi mtu ni muheshimu kwa kweli yani kama atika hatuwezi kusema sababu kila mtu tunamuheshimu lakini mtu kupata kadi kuwakilisha na maana ni bahati na sisitiza dress code kwa sisi wanaume tunavaa mavuni lakini kwa wanawake wanavaa flash pink watoto wa mjini mnaijua bana so uh, ni wakaribishe wote na nasubia kwa hamu of course so i can say oh. ushesikia vile ambavyo nasema ukijaribu kuja ku show stop na ku stop uko kwa mlango <laughs> hey, si yako hivi <laughs> shuli si yako shuli si yako lakini watu wanaenda kwa kana tabia mbaya sana yeah, uki, kama una akaa nyumbani basi do not attend eh Oh, yeah. don't be disrespectful because honestly yeah. that's the reason why I keep like to people's like themes and dress codes you're being disrespectful to the person who threw that party I love you wedabu know? vatu ile gown ya red na alikuwa amevalisha nyinyi wote blush pink ndio ya by black ama red alafu mkwe kuna red mbili watata ni nani eh but here to rules lakini mmeona nani umeona huyo msizo amemwangalia up close vizuri mzee amemwangalia up close jana kijana kwa sababu sasa tunaweza haya sawa basi moving on to america the usa there's already a lieutenant who goes by the name madeline swigel who has become the first black woman to be um, awarded with a tactical let me just find the right before i say the wrong things um she has been um awarded she's the first black female tactical pilot in the navy she has made history and this happened um on friday 31st of july and she went on to social media to share her excitement and her joy and she said i am excited to have this opportunity to work harder and fly high performance jet aircrafts in in the fleet she said So yes oh after boy. I don't know how long the navy has been around but let's assume it's a very long time and this is the first time there's a black woman pilot so she has made history mm, Yeah man congratulations At 31 It's like that time we were talking about that lady who made it as a as a cruise captain mm. on a cruise ship Yeah on a cruise yeah. ship Yeah yeah yeah, yeah. 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 Mm, yeah. Mm. I'm like girls you can do it all Black girl You magic. can be everything mm. when you wanna say mango wezi kuwa artist sijua tukasi si hatuwezi kuwa ah, bibi jamani We can still be wacky we can still be wives we can we still, can still be friends we can be anything that we want to be 